What is up guys, this is Redhead420 here to bring you guys a reaction video to one of the best games of this year, Kingdom Hearts 3, but they're having a Remind DLC trailer. Um, two times it's kind of been uh, like let known that there will be a DLC for Kingdom Hearts 3. The first time was the orchestra event, and then the second time there was another orchestra event. And I believe they saw this trailer, or maybe a modified trailer. But this is going to be an E3 uh, 2019 trailer. I don't know if this kind of confirms that Kingdom Hearts 3 won't be at uh, Square Enix's uh, press conference. I have no idea. There's still the likelihood of them showing up to show more, like, an in-depth um, close-up to, like, the actual DLC. But who knows. But let's get into this reaction because I'm so hyped. I really enjoyed Kingdom Hearts 3. Oh snap. Who's this? Sorry. Coat wards off darkness. Wait a minute, it's useful. Why is Xehanort time to sign yellow? So how'd it go? The world tour? Oh man. In an awful way. Realize just how necessary I am. Oh. Yes, we get to play as Riku. Hell yeah, Aqua. Dude, this is hyped, Roxas. My boy, Roxas. Roxas, let's go. Woo. Okay, that might be a new form for Sora. Zigbar, who are all oh, Luxor knows. That he's not really Zigbar. Hey, it doesn't make a difference to me anyway. I'll just keep playing dumb. This isn't Hercules world, I believe. Push is who are you? Oh shoot, Luxor. Yo, that's awesome. That means Luxord might be playing a bigger part in the next uh, set of Kingdom Hearts games because he knows that Zigbar isn't who he's saying. Like, he knows he's playing them. He knows he's somebody else. Which we know, if you guys haven't already played Kingdom Hearts 3, that he's Lushu. But we don't know who Luxord is at all. So that's going to be interesting. I don't think we're going to know in this DLC. It's most likely going to be talked about in the next uh, upcoming Kingdom Hearts games, but yet again, we don't know when those games will come out because Nomura is working on Final Fantasy 7, but overall, I love it. I really enjoyed this trailer, but uh, I don't know if that's just going to be it when it comes to the DLC, just playable characters. I don't know if we're going to have to like switch off or give us an option when we're, you know, fighting um, those uh, set of, you know, Xehanorts. So I have no idea because um, so I, I just hope they show this at E3. I really want them to kind of go in depth with it. But overall, I, I'm excited. I'm very, very happy. As a Kingdom Hearts fan, I'm happy. So guys, let me know in the comments section below. Are you guys happy? Are you excited to be playing as Roxas, Riku, or Aqua? And to kind of get more of a backstory to uh, Luxor and Lushu. <laughs> But guys, um, thank you guys for watching. Make sure to hit the like button as well as subscribe if you want to see more content from my channel. And hit the bell notification so you guys can get updated as when my videos go up. Make sure to follow me on Twitter at Redhead240. And follow me on Twitch today because I will be live streaming Microsoft's press conference. But I will also be posting uh, videos for the games onto this channel. So, uh, so you guys can keep an update as like what games are being announced. So... Hope you guys are having a fantastic day. This is Redhead420, signing off.